Hey guys, what's up? Um, it's midnight here. Tuesday. Eee, happy Thomas Tuesday. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be doing a Hiddleston question tag. Um, which was created by at Edelman Sarah on Twitter. Shout out, you are awesome. Um, so <laughs> somebody told me I should be, like, I should start, um, doing shoutouts every single time I make a vlog, so I might as well just do that. Um, make a single, make shoutouts to, um, you know, my favorite, my favorite people. So, yeah. <laughs> Sorry! Um, first question. Uh, oh, by the way, the reason why I'm making this, um, not shoot. <laughs> reason why I'm making this video I'm making this into a video is because I talk way too much and the first question which asks um, how did you discover Tom my story uh, well it's not too long but I have to I have to explain it because it won't fit into a single tweet or new or something. <laughs> it would take forever. But, yeah, I'm just making it in video form. Instead of tweet form. I don't like tweet forms. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Well, I... First off, I saw Tom in the Avengers. And... Uh, I was in a relationship at that time. So, I didn't give a shit about celebrity crushes then, because of that, um, so, you know, uh, but yeah, forgot about him, forgot about him for a little while, eee, don't hurt me, <laughs> but then my sister brought him up again, like, a couple years later, in 2014, um, which was at this time, actually, um, I think, I think, like, at the end of April or something that she brought him up again I was like she was playing video games and I was sitting here on my laptop you know looking up shit for Comic Con and all that bull crap because at that time I was really obsessed with Doctor Who which I still love Doctor Who it's amazing uh one of the, my favorite freaking TV show ever um but yeah I was doing that, trying to see if they were gonna, you know, the cast was gonna be at, uh, Wizard World, or whatever the hell they were gonna have in California, like that. So, she was asking, is Tom Hiddleston on there? So I'm like, who? What? <laughs> Ooh. I'm sorry, Tom. <laughs> but, you know, I, like, I don't know. I don't know who you're talking about. And then she was like, Loki! And I'm like, God damn it! <laughs> no. Not there. And she was like, Oh, but you really have to listen to that interview, um, for, uh, Nerdist. That he did for Nerdist. And with, uh, Chris Hardwick and like that before. Crap, what was that interview? That was like in 2013. And, um, well, before that, no. Crap. Before or after she brought that up, I watched I watched Thor and Thor: The Dark World. So <clears throat> I think that was after she brought him up, yeah. And before we went to go see Captain America: The Winter Soldier. So we ended up listening to like um, a couple minutes of the interview, and then she wanted to go see the movie, so. And we got in the car, and she put on the interview, and then went straight to the theater, and then after that, after we got out, we put the interview back on and listened to it all the way <laughs> And after that, ooh, I was like, ooh, <laughs> this guy's pretty interesting. I'd like to, you know, listen to more of his interviews and try to figure him out. So... And before before that, while I was in the um, 
Adam Lambert fandom, which was my first fandom, um, I suddenly, like, I kept seeing, kept seeing, like, um, Hiddlestoner, like, all over, all over the place on, well, not really all over the place, but just, like, at some, some places on, on Twitter. I was like, what is that? <laughs> what does that mean? And then I heard, then I, I heard about Tom a few times, and I was like, who is this person? Like, I, I knew, I didn't know this fandom all too well, but I was kind of curious as to what you guys were capable of and all that stuff, so I kept that, I kept that thought in my mind until after I, um, <coughs> disappeared from fandoms for a while. So, and then my sister brought him up again, and I was like, sweet! <laughs> Get to get to join join the fandom again and like that so wanted to give it a try and here I am year number two in this one um so this is pretty exciting met some cool new new friends I meet new friends all the time and it's it's amazing and I hope to keep doing that um yeah, after that interview, I was hooked, so, yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know what pulled me in, though. I think just, just him in general is so fucking interesting and amazing. I keep saying amazing, so that's my favorite word. <laughs> um, but, <sighs> inspiring Tom quote. It would have to be, um, I should have that one on hand because every single time I make this video I have to go I have to go find it. <laughs> um dum dum well, I know where it is though. In my first my first folder on here. The best thing about this iPod is you get to transfer your photo albums like directly from your computer onto this so you don't have to find all the pictures again. So that's fantastic. Okay. Never let anyone tell you what you can and can't do. Prove the cynics wrong. Pity them, for they have no imagination. Sky's the limit. Your sky, your limit. Now, let's dance. <coughs> His quotes get me through the hard times. Like, uh, and just, you know. <laughs> All of you do the same thing, though. Him and his fans get me through tough shit, even though I don't talk about it on Twitter. So, I usually keep the bad shit to myself. Try to help other people. I mean, I don't like to... I don't know. I'm just kind of the introvert. Where I just, like, favorite tweets and then... I don't know. And tweet happy things to everyone and tag... and tag everybody in those. So, just to make you guys smile, I guess. I just feel like that's what I've, that's what I've been put on this, like, I don't know, I feel like that's what I'm here to do, my purpose in life, to make other people happy, that's good, that's good, <laughs> all is good, um, describe your favorite Tom outfit, oh lord, oh no, <laughs> the red plaid shirt, that's a killer, <laughs> That's a killer for me. Um, uh, leather jacket and the blue. Um, I think his V necks. V necks are good. Um, the white shirt. Um, <laughs> jeans. Uh, um, do you plan on meeting Tom someday? You shouldn't have to ask me that question because. <laughs> You guys know the answer to that. Of course I do. <coughs> and dancing. Dancing. <laughs> dancing is in, will be involved. Ugh. Um. Link to favorite time interview. 
I'm not gonna link because I'm a lazy turd, but <laughs> my favorite Tom interview would have to be the Popcorn Taxi interview because it's set in Australia and it's so much fun. He sings happy birthday to people and he's just Yes, no, you've seen that interview. <laughs> it's a great interview. Um, which upcoming movie are you most excited for? Uh, probably have to be all of them. <laughs> Crimson Peak, High Rise, I Saw the Light. Uh, aside from film, The Night Manager. I'm excited to see Tom on my television every week. So, that'll be amazing. I know he'll do a great job. Um... Uh, da 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 da, Skull Island. That is a huge one for me. Because I just bought, I just bought all the in it. It's his! Jeez! Indiana Jones films, and Jurassic Park, and King Kong, and I have Godzilla. So, because I, I don't have them on DVD at all. They're mostly on tape. So, I grew up with those films. So this is gonna, uh, this is gonna top every single, every single one of them, I think. Um, but yeah, that one, that one's biggie. Um, moving on, I keep it up. Something you love most about Tom? Everything. <laughs> Um, his positivity, his, uh, kindness, um, his humor. I love his humor a lot. Um, I think those three. The way he carries himself, I guess. I don't know. Uh, how real he is. Um, his humility. Um, how he doesn't like he doesn't call his fans obsessive so like passionate that's good um, he doesn't look down on anyone he doesn't treat others like um, differently like um, from friends from his friends fans and everything. You, you guys know what I mean, but, yeah. Good. He's a good role model. I'm happy to have him as a role model. <laughs> um, tag your top three favorite Tom fan accounts. Um, Hills Goddesses, um, Hills Educates, and Hills the Lover. So, love you guys. Yeah! <laughs> Spread the love. <laughs> um, which which Tom character are you most obsessive over, or whatever? First of all, not obsessive, but I besides Loki, I really really love Freddie Page from the Deep Blue Sea because, um, well. I don't know, I can really relate to Rachel's character, but, um, I don't know, I, I just really love his character, so, I don't know, I don't know how to explain that one. That was the first movie I've ever seen Tom in, besides, uh, Thor and the Avengers and Thor the Dark World, so, um, good, good, good. It was a good one. That's my favorite Tom film. What what Tom movie have you not yet seen? Uh, Midnight in Paris. I've only seen his little his little snippet in there. You know, I just got Fitzgerald, so I will have to watch the whole thing. So there. Uh, then I have to tag ten people. I will do that. So get in this video. Bye guys. I love you all so much, and thank you very much for watching.